שוחחתי הערב עם נשיא ארה״ב ג'ו ביידן. דיברנו על ההתפתחויות האחרונות במלחמה, לרבות המחויבות של ישראל להשיג את כל מטרות המלחמה, חיסול החמאס, שחרור כל חטופינו, והבטחה שעזה לא תהווה יותר איום על ישראל, תוך כדי מתן הסיוע ההומניטרי ההכרחי, שמסייע להשיג את המטרות הללו. On the call today, President Biden asked the Prime Minister to send a senior interagency team composed of military, intelligence, and humanitarian officials to Washington in the coming days to hear U.S. concerns about Israel's current Rafa planning and to lay out an alternative approach that would target key Hamas elements in Rafa and secure the Egypt-Gaza border without a major ground invasion. The Prime Minister agreed that he would send a team. Obviously, he has his own point of view on a Rafa operation, but he agreed that he would send a team to Washington to have this discussion and have this engagement. And we look forward to those discussions. So we have taken steps. The President reaffirmed today the need for Israel to do everything in its power, and even more than it has already done, uh, to address the humanitarian crisis. And obviously, we saw a UN report today, which uh, Director Power of USAID spoke to quite eloquently. It's an alarming report about a possible impending famine if everyone doesn't do their responsibility to ensure we address that. That starts first and foremost with Israel, who has an obligation to step up and ensure that more is done to deliver food to starving people in northern Gaza. But it's also incumbent on us, the United States, and the rest of the international community to step up as well.